Salsa is a social activity that is practiced in couples and usually is learned in classes with the assistance of a teacher. However, it is generally difficult to assist and to be engaged to these classes due to time or location restrictions. In this work, we have designed a virtual reality application that allows people to interact with a virtual partner and learn basic salsa dance skills through a gamified environment. The virtual partner is animated using inverse kinematics for both arms and feet. The feet follow a dance pattern and the music in a forward-backward motion named Mambo or in a left-right motion named Cucaracha. The virtual partner's hands are snapped to the user's hands via controllers and follow them giving the impression of a real interaction. In this way, the user interacts with the virtual character and performs basic salsa dance movements in accordance to the given music. The user can transmit the information of changing dance patterns from Mambo to Cucaracha and vice versa by applying a force at the right time is guiding its partner in a real dance scenario. This gives a feeling of movement interaction in a similar way to a real dance scenario with a partner. The main aim of our application is to help users dance on the provided rhythm and at the same time guide the virtual partner to transit from one dance pattern to another every two cycles. At the end, the user gets an evaluation score based on these two criteria. To evaluate the performance of our application in stimulating dance learning progress, each user went through eight exercises with various tempos. The motion of the user is recorded at six points using motion capture technology as to enable motion analysis and the evaluation of the performance. We used the well-known methods for analyzing our motion data. The music motion features, such as the step accuracy or the feet synchronization, and the Laban movement analysis features, such as the distance between the end effectors or the body volume of the performer over time. To evaluate the performance of our dance platform in improving the user's learning skills, we recorded a set of people from two main categories, non-dancers, which are people with no dance experience, and regular dancers, which are people that have taken salsa classes for at least one year. Their performance is analyzed using the MMF and the LMA features and evaluated before and after training. More specifically, we have extracted a number of music motion features for each user at different exercises and compared their average values prior and after training. We then compared the motion profiles between the first on the left and the last exercises on the right for the known and regular dancers. It can be observed that the two classes are easily distinguishable for the early exercises but as we move forward for the latest exercises, these differences are getting smaller. Similarly, we have extracted a number of effective and consistent LMA features for various users and for different exercises. Again, it can be observed that the two classes can be separated at the beginning of the training, but as the performers gain more experience through our virtual environment, the two classes are mixed up. 
By assuming the regular dancers have good learning skills, the convergence of the non-dancers' profiles to those of the regular dancers indicates that the overall guidance and rhythm profiles of the users have been improved, thus validating the learning effect of our training. As a conclusion, in this work, we have designed a VR application that simulates salsa dance practice and allows people to enhance their skills through dance gamification, making them ready to continue the dance journey. Thank you.